Hello there and welcome back to some more Breath of the Wild. In the last episode, we were in West Nekluda, apparently. It's been a while since I actually played. Now this new uh, schedule gets me recording on Monday and Tuesday and then I don't play Breath of the Wild for five days. So, I am a little bit out of sorts with where I am and what I'm doing. And we have a little look. Ah, yes, I remember. I was going to go up to the Dueling Peaks because there's a shrine up there. And... We also increased our inventory space. Ah, oh, yeah. Hell yeah. There we go. Bye. Uh-oh. It's a big boy. That's my sword broken. Next weapon. Oops. There we go. I thought you could backflip that. That tutorial actually helped me knowing that sideways attacks you can pretty much always backflip. Alright. Okay, let's keep going. Uh, I've actually got to get up here though. Hopefully the rain will stop by the time I make a decent attempt at getting up it. It seems to be not that bad. Come on. I'm just trying to buy some time. It's like another hour in-game time of this rain. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. It says nine now. With the inclusion of the hat. Shit on my tits. That's bad. I fell all the way down. Anyway, it's nine now. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so it's random still. Five is the safe one. Got it. This is why rain is such a problem. What? Oh, now it's not wet anymore. The mountains dry out quick in this part of the world. Easy peasy. You're gonna have to put away my climbing gear soon because it's gonna get cold. But it shouldn't be too bad for now. Look at this absolute unit clambering up this hill. It's nothing. Well, it's not too cold, though. We're just going to go for the ultimate climbing strats. Because why not? It makes sense. At least to me. Just to go full. I was not paying attention. I was looking at my microphone. I was not paying attention to my stamina gauge. That's uh, my mistake. I know I can make this climb. I just can't do it like I was doing it. I'm only going to make it to this lip. There we go. This is better. Now 
now we should be able to get up here soon. There we go. Now there could be stuff over there, but I'm not particularly interested in that stuff right now. I'm interested in getting to this shrine. I think this is the one I want to be on first, because this is the taller of the two hills. It's easy to go from the tall one to the small one. I do believe this is correct. Okay. Thanks for that insight. Oh, there's a shrine here, by the way. No. Really? I think it goes super cold too, so it's like level 2 cold. It's in your grandma's level 1 cold. Okay, so first things first, we'll get the cold jumper on. That will protect us against level 1 coldness. But then as soon as we get closer, I think it becomes level 2 coldness. There's the shine. They're actually both on this mountain. That makes my life even easier. Trying to score a goal. Come on, you beauty. Rolled right. Okay. No joy. I mean, I get basically infinite tries because I can go in the shrine and reset it if I want. Also try and use uh, stasis to knock it through the goal. I do an actual volley. Hell yeah! There we go. You found me. Bye. -bye. So, there's this shrine. We're acutely aware of. Is that the path down there? If that's the case, I haven't actually come up that high. Okay, now I've just got to climb up this. Monstrosity. Get into an area that's a bit nicer, Joey. A crevice that's going to take a lot less out of you. attempting to push me. I shan't have any of it. I'll make this dream happen. By hook or by crook. 
so I shall. I've got plenty of stamina to do it with. So I've got to be patient. It's not my strong suit, though. Patience. Okay. Here we go. This should be enough of a ridge to, if not climb on, then at least walk up. Yes, sir. There we go. Okay. Shivanir Shrine. So, excuse me. I'm very busy. Got things to do. So, excuse me. You're lucky I'm going down with shiny little shit. Twin memories. The shrines atop these peaks share a connection. The memory the answer to the other's question. Commit to memory before you start, lest a failure you will depart. So you don't get what that means, don't worry, I didn't either the first time I played it. I was like, wait, what the fuck are you talking about? Because I didn't know this was a mirrored shrine. Um, this is the solution to the other shrine. So let's read it from left to right. It's 31425. 31425. Crack the old pen out. I thought about doing this just in my head. But then I was like, no, because I'm going to have to remember the other solution as well. So let's just get a pen out. Three, one, four, two, five. Okay. The way I say that's three is because the top left is one, one. So that's three, one, four, two, five. Technically, if I was doing it in the mathematically correct way, the bottom left would be naught naught, and you'd go from there. But this makes sense to me, so that's what I'm doing. Three one forty five for that one. Now I can walk back to this shrine when I want, so it doesn't matter. We got this one. Shivanath Shrine. I think these are the two closest shrines in proximity on the map that exist in the game. They're like right next to each other. Just as far as the game is concerned, they're actually much lower than each other. Okay. This other one is... It would be... I would say it would be two, three, five, which would be like with um, a hyphen in between. Zero, four, one. So let me write that down. So this is two, three, five, zero, four, Okay, and then the solution to this one is 31425. Fine. Boom. Now, <clears throat> excuse me. How do I find the right amount of shrines? And how are the chests? I am not very well, so if I cough sometimes, I apologize. It's only going to be like very sharp, short coughs like that. So. To clear the old throat of phlegm. Haha. <laughs> the 
there's a reason that I remembered going up here. Alright. Serpentine Spear. The Spear Island's weapon is uniquely Sheikah in design. Spear Masters of the Sheikah tribe can use this crescent shape to snag their opponents and deliver brutal cuts. That's pretty neat, though. Alright. Give me that orb, baby. Thank you. Two more then, we'll have a heart jamboree. I'll have 15. Let's see if I can go get the sword. Okay, sweet. Now for the other one, I'll just walk back to it. Yes, I am that lazy. And we'll see what uh, shrines we can see from here, if any. Okay, just mute my microphone. That one's a particularly bad one. Right. The solution to this is 235041. Yes, I say O oh, instead of zero sometimes. It means the same thing to me. So, if it's two. Three and five. Then zero. Then four, then one. Chuck it. <laughs> so I guess if I wanted to do this in like an array, this would be uh, zero. Well, actually, it'd be weird because array starts at zero. So it'd be zero, one, one, zero. Yeah, zero, one, one, zero, and one, two. Nothing. Three, one, and four, four. I hate arrays. They're not that bad. It's just me sucking at understanding them. Here we go. Eight flow, eight flowed? The eight flowed bong blade, yes. A single edged sword, seldom seen in high world. The weapon is passed down through the Sheikah tribe and is an astonishingly sharp edge, ideal for slicing and blazing it. Okay. That's all the. All the sh uh, chests in this room. We got them. Pack it up, boys. Job's done. Alright. I'll be taking that orb, thank you. And, for now, ta-ta! Oh, one more shrine to we have 60. Nice. Big fan. And I mean that sincerely. Big old massive fan of that one. I understand it's hard to tell sometimes with me whether I'm being sincere or not. Let's call it a quality... Uh, let's, let's call it a trait rather than me being an asshole. Alright, that's the shrine, that's the uh, tower rather, the place I want to go next. So, that's cool. Ooh. Apple morph. Alright. 
Here, have an apple. Bonk. You found me. Bye bye. Hell yeah. Okay. So now it's going into the great beyond. I guess I'll go down towards here. Makes sense to me, but if I'm going to do that. Hang on. There's a method to my madness, I promise. I'm just going to jump off from the right angle straight away. It may save me literally zero time, but it's the logical thing to do. You should always jump. If, if there's no wind in, uh, direction influence, which there isn't really, straight lines are always the fastest way to go. So that's what I'm going to do. Eventually this shit's going to warm up and we'll be fine again. Mm, sailing and drifting through the air like a bird without a care. Okay, right. Enough of that. If I could make it onto this grassy ridge down below, that would be sweet. If not, I'll take this grassy ridge. I'm going to have to course correct before I fall and die. There. That'll do. As you get further afield, pretty much any guardian you see that's there is alive. They just can't help themselves. Yeah, I'm about halfway. That's not too bad. I should be able to get that in the next ten minutes. We'll look around for some more shiny roos. Think about that. There are 40 shrines left. Five here. Five here. Five here. Five here. Five here. Would be 25. Which would mean I'm missing 50, uh, 15. No. Yeah. Because there's 100. So. There must be more than that. But these areas are quite big. So there could be more than five in any one of these regions. Or less. we get into the almost fog but it's more like heat stank it's quite strange Baron Tower. I'm going straight in. Boom. Shika Tower activated. Big old messy jungle. For me to get lost in. Scanning area.
Gotta go to the spring. Oh, no, that's, that's the old region. This is the new region. Gotta go... To this lake. Gotta go up here. I've gotta go... Well, that's definitely something. Uh... It's hard to know where, which one I've been to and which one I ain't. Okay. Oh, I've definitely been here. But I don't think I've been any further than this. Okay, then. What the hell is that? Go go find out what that is too. And then later on I'll go down to here. And then over here. Okay, so first things first, down to red. We might get some shrine bleeps on the way, but I wouldn't hold my breath. Oh. Asking you shall receive, I suppose. This is also where we get the bananas from. Ah. Well, it's kind of cheating. There's a shrine here because there's a stable here. Isn't this one... Yeah, it's like behind here. It's not that obvious. Shah Yulto Shrine. Alright. No problem. Don't be shy, Yuto. Hopefully it'll be fine. Ah, lovely. Nice. Halt the Tilt. What a name. So, just as a Obviously, I know what's going to happen if you do this. <laughs> so, we stop it. Puzzle solved. Great job, everyone. Go home. Now, there might be other ways of doing this, like using objects. That are heavier than you are. For example, this box might help me. Knight's board sword. Knights of Hyrule once carried the sword. These days it's the weapon of choice for seasoned adventurers thanks to its ease of use and high attack power. Now, immediately back to... No room at the inn. You thought we were done, now we had more infantry slots. Ha ha ha, no. Okay, uh... Right, let's try this. I don't know that this chest is heavier than Link is. Ah, it won't stay on the platform. That's a problem. Oh, it's heavier. Okay. So I need to get it towards the moment. Like, in the middle of the thing. So it tips over. And then quickly go. Then, can I throw a bomb on it? Or does the bombs have no weight? It has weight. Do you want to know why I'm doing that? It's so I can get the chest back. Hmm. Maybe I can get it back from this side. Haven't got all the chests yet, so... Aha! Come to me, chest. I don't know why I expected it to happen, but it wasn't that. Yeah, 
here. We haven't got all the chests, so there must be something else going on here. I now realize what I have to do. Something like that. Where the fuck? Oh, there it is. I was like, where the fuck did my chest go? Something like that. But actually, I think on this side will be better. right on the edge of the platform, which means I've got to actually be on it by the time I do this, so I don't have to fuck about with any other nonsense. Yeah. There. More than enough height. Ancient core! Snowball flap. Okay, we got that. And give me my orb. Thank you. May the goddess smile upon you. The goddess hasn't smiled on me in a hot minute. Legside stable. Legside more like lag side. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But please give us a switch to. Oh, so you're here too. It seems fate is balanced together. What are you looking for? What are you selling? What have you got? I forgot I'm poor. Thanks for the business. You need anything else? No, I'm good. Rumor Mill Volume 6. Tracy here bringing you the latest news and gossip from morning to night. Growing blue bunny. A long time ago, there was a skilled hunter. On the way back from a hunt, he saw a light moving in the darkness. Without hesitation, he fired an arrow towards it, and where he had been, he found a bunch of rupees. From that day forward, whenever he saw a similar light, he would fire an arrow at it. He always found rupees where his target had been, and he grew quite rich. Or so the story goes. I bet you think it's just a myth, right? Then what do you say about all the people who claim to have seen a glowing blue bunny in the forest lately? You'd probably say, oh, Tracy, thank you for writing volume 6. Sound about right? You should say that, because the blue bunny is the light the hunter saw. Finding it means finding lots and lots of rupees. I can't endure this bit endorse this bit of gossip enough. Tracy's recommendation, five stars. Wait, I don't know how to use a bow and arrow. That really puts a damper on things. Tracy's recommendation, one star. Lexide Stable is a great place for me to cook loads of different dishes and increase the number of recipes I know. Oh. Hey, buddy, got a map? I have one, yeah. So on this map yours, you see Jordan Peach to the north of here? Well, apparently this was just one mountain a really long time ago. Legends say a dragon god split the mountain in half to forge a way through, and that's how it went from one to two. Recently, some have even saying they've seen the shadow of a large creature on the surface of Lake Floria. I wonder if any of that's true. Hey. Oh dear, oh dear. Lightning strikes the stable soft, and I get nervous whenever it even rains a little. I don't understand why it strikes off, and hey, it's a long shot, but if you have some time, could you find out why? Leave it to me. You will, really? I'm so happy I'm counting on you. Thunder Magnet. 
Well, we saw why. Like, we know full well why. Don't slip and slide, buddy. Need to climb onto the horse's head. <laughs> Up you get, buddy. It's because this axe is drawing attention. Obviously. Speaking of, I could use a new axe. Gotcha. I'll look after you. What? You found out I was drawing the lightning here? It was a metal axe. Aha! Oh, that's as good as a lightning rod, isn't it? I wonder if someone put it up there on purpose. How strange. Thanks for looking into it for me. Here's something for your trouble. Ooh. A helmet made from ancient techniques and electricity resistant material. It's made from something called rubber. A material that can no longer be found. You can finally relax. There you go. Well. I mean, it's not as good as the Thunder Helm, which is lightning immunity, but it'll do. You know, it's free. Hello, ball. Hello, mate. Hello. Oh, oh dear. Oh, dear lord. No one speak of this. No one ever speak of this, okay? I hear a... Crawl rock rattler. Is it on the bridge? Or above it? Oh, it's there. The pinwheel. Ooh, that's going to be a tough shot. A bit higher. A bit higher still. Boom. All right. It's over. Yeah. I'm not an expert marksman yet. You found me. Bye bye. Well, that's not really what I wanted to do. Oh well, it's fine. We can climb this tree back up. I also forgot something very important. It'll only take about two seconds to go get, so it's not a big deal at all either. I didn't note it when I saw it because I was like, yeah, I'll get that. And then I forgot to get it because I'm an idiot. Uh, the stable has a beard. Most stables don't have, well, maybe they do and I've just not noticed. But this one definitely has a beard and it's made of leaves. And I told you a, lot, a while ago that Korox hide under leaves. You have to burn away the leaves. Now, how would I do that? With those fire arrows I procured, of course. Assuming I still have any. You. Okay, I need to find another source of light. What I need to do is set something on fire and then shoot an arrow through it. You know what? I'll do it when I have some fire arrows. Let's stop. Let's stop fucking around. Okay, now I want to go over to this side of the bridge, definitely. This is where I might have remembered seeing the dragon. I may have misremembered. Try 
la la la. I have arrived in the lag zone. Uh -oh. Bye. No more taluses don't concern me. They're not scary. Anything beyond a normal talus, though. Ice or fire or whatever, they do scare me. A lot. more than I bargained for. Great. It's raining. Making this otherwise very manageable hill completely unmanageable. How did that one hit me? This guy's the fucking aim of a legend. He can't even see me. Try and hit me now. Dickhead. I'm going to pencil that under unlikely. So, I'll never get over how annoying this is to have to climb so slow. It's a, it's a miracle to even get this far. You know what? Fuck off. Phone call. Will my mum get it or will someone else get it? Let's see. Oh, my mum got it. Okay. Great. Quickly now. Give me that core. You found me. Bye bye. Damn right, I found you. Can't hide from me. Okay, it's only quick. It's an actual dry storm. It was. It's called for the Thunder Helm. Does unfortunately mean slower climbing, but I might 
garage to get somewhere. I'll give the rupees a go. Whoa, hello. Yes, this is lightning zone forever. Which makes it incredibly hard to climb. using Vali's Gale a, a, a bunch of times. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to wait for it to come back. I'm going to use Vali's Gale to get up here. It's one of those moves that doesn't take long to come back, which is good. Vali's Gale is now ready. Okay. Right. So. The thing about Vali's Gale is you've got to know uh how far it can actually take you. Otherwise it's a waste. Right. So, pretty sure it can't get me all the way up here, but we'll test it. It can get me all the way up here, just about perfectly. Okay, great. That's just a chest in the ground, okay. Five regular arrows. Ooh, you shouldn't have. No, really, you shouldn't have. It's a waste of everyone's fucking time. now. Fuck you, Keys. I'm busy. Where's Cass? I need to speak to him because he needs to tell me the riddle. So I can say, yeah, I did it. There he is. I love watching the electricity just literally strike me and it doesn't matter. Very impressive. Not many could make it up here in such rain. I expect no less from a well-worn traveler like yourself. Me? I stay nice and dry. My feathers repel the rain rather well. And my instrument was designed to withstand extreme moisture. <laughs> when your livelihood revolves around ancient songs, you've got to be prepared for a few raindrops. I know a song about this place. Would you like to hear the ancient verse passed down in the region? Sure, let's hear it. Ooh. Excellent, without further ado. When a lost hero calls down lightning from the sky. The monk responds from a giant mound on high. Ah, so there was a shrine inside that crag split by lightning. The bot was so ferocious that I would have might be struck down myself. I tell it's worthy of being immortalized in song. Anyway, may the light shine ever on your path. Nah, mate, don't worry about the lightning. It's fine. Okay, so Kukanata's blessing. What's this gonna be? 
Answers on a postcard. It's rubber. These are valuable types of resistance to electricity. They're made with something called rubber, an ancient technology that only exists in this modern age. So now I've got the full rubber set. Which will be useful against certain enemies. But, Thunderhelm, pretty strong. Overall. I wonder if this makes the lightning go away. I don't think so. I think it's still raining in that region forever. Which makes exploring it very frustrating. Usually when you don't need something to be a certain way anymore. Oh, it is fixed. Great. Uh, they turn it off. You know what I mean? So it's not such a pain in the ass forever. Okay, so gotta go to yellow, then gotta go to. I mean, I haven't actually been to red. I looked at it, but I didn't go to it. Right, let's go over here. Where is it? It's the big forest. I've been a ways. It's up here. Okay. That's a long way away. Ah, lovely. Okay. Also, Hestu's here. Um, I need to go to the shrine, though. Forget, is there a shrine in here? Ba -ba -ba -ba. <laughs> what an absolute banger. Not that I can see, so instead, because it's faster. Go here. There's definitely a shrine here. I mean, a uh, goddess statue. I need to get more HP and then I'm going to try and pull the stone out of the ground. Or the sword, even. From the stone. Hello. You have conquered the shrines and claimed their spirit orbs. Give me a heart container, please. Thank you. Ah. Hi. Go and bring peace to Hyrule. I don't think I have enough hearts yet. I, need, I think I need one more, but we'll try. Let's give it a good old go. The old college try. Also. I was going to say, see your Eightfold Blade, but I've already thrown it away. I'll go speak to Hestu first. I need to get more... ...weapon. Shalaka! It's you! I need again! What's with the silent treatment? Don't you remember me? I'm the musician of Korok Forest, Hestu! I'm impressed you found your way through the Lost Woods and made it here. So have you brought me any Korok seeds? I sure hope so. I hope you've returned my lost Korok seeds to me like the size of the inventory, which is actually one of the slotted weapon, please. Sure, okay, I just need three Korok seeds, do you? Yes. Let the expansion begin! <laughs> Every other time we're going to skip it now. Just so you know. But every time I do this the first time, I'll show you the 
animation. Expand a burn band, weapons chash, shakala. So then, 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 do you want to expand another stash? Please don't talk like that. Ever again. I mean, it's not much of a skip, but it skips something. See, it's like the Fibonacci. It's getting up higher and higher and higher, faster and faster. Pew! I'm gonna keep going in weapons until I can't anymore. Yep, that's fine. It's not quite the Fibonacci. That would have been 13 if it was. But it seems inspired by it. Okay. Yes, please. Yeah, that's fine. Right, so that's 15 weapon slots. That should be more than enough for now. Now I'm going to do shield and bow as well. Because why not? Mm -hmm. Like I said, it starts at 1 again. Oh shit, I fucked up. I'm gonna show you the green one because it is different. Expand a bamboo bow stash, Shakala. Yeah, sure, bow stash piece. Two cork seeds. Here you go. Sorry. I mean, it is the same except it's green, but it's different enough that I'll let you watch it again. Alright, let's get to 10 bows. And then 10 shields. I should have enough seeds for that. I didn't calculate it precisely, but I was pretty confident. Guess what colour the uh, shield is going to be. Actually, you get no points for guessing it's blue. You know, RGB, classic. Alright. Five, and then eight. As long as I have more than 25, I should be fine. Yeah, I, I will. Now I can actually start picking up the duplex bows I kill from the, uh, the Yeager. Now the Yeager will never fucking show up again, but that's fine. Yes. You may have my seeds. No, I then. Alright, so I've got 10 bow slots. Then, shield stash, please. Should care, any one cork seed? Yes, please. There you go. I mean, it's not... Uh, shields are a bit of a weird one, because I don't actually find that many shields. But... I might as well just get it so that for at least a while I won't have to worry about getting rid of anything. I can just pick shields up as I find them. Even if they're shit quality shields. Just to have them. Use them as surfboards or whatever. Snowboard even. Wow, it's just a, a shield board. Land board? I don't fucking know. There's a special name for something that's not just specifically for one type of terrain. It looks like the limit might be 20 of each time. Which should actually be plenty. I should never need more than 20 weapons at any one time. And you're always finding new ones. Enemy camps have them. Enemies in general tend to have weapons of some kind, even if they're not very good. You might run into the problem of... Uh, Feeling like you need more weapons than you've got. Of a higher quality, like, oh, my weapons are all 
poopy bums. Yeah, mate. Okay, one more shield. And then we'll be good. Ten? What? Shields are getting more expensive. Okay. Thanks, Estu. Nothing right now. Okay, then. Bye bye. Alright, so th that took long enough that now, next time, cliffhanger, I know I'm an asshole. Next time, we're gonna have to see if we can pull out the sword from the stone. See you then. Goodbye.